Hello. I I'm gonna style. That's not that's not that's not what I wanted to say. I'm going to prep my hair and I'll be back because I don't know why I started the video and I decided not to prep my hair. I'm back. Um, I've got product on my ears. That's fine. Um, but today I'm really hoping this works. Really hoping this works. Today I'm going to see whether or not I can get my hair styled with mousse only mousse i am terrified i don't know if you know this but using mousse on like really curly hair isn't always a go i'm just trying to like grab it without like moving on the camera but like using mousse on hair that is a really isn't a good idea a lot of times so fingers crossed that it'll work and i'll get it done and i just need to wear that that is for another video um um but if it does work i'm gonna be very pleased because i have to leave today like i'm going out and i do not want to style my hair and then i'm gonna have to restyle it or like fix it something but fingers crossed that it works i'm going to use two different mousses mousses mousse mousse nice <laughs> um but i've got the curlsmith one this is the bouncy strength volume foam it will. yeah there you go bouncy strength volume foam and it's for curly and wavy hair i don't know if the fact that this wavy stresses me out but we shall see if it works right it has an invisible hold like it tells you on uh, their products it's number two so it has an invisible hold which means that it's not a very strong hold which again terrifies me because my hair is very not welcoming to um most this one is essentially done so i don't know if i want to use this one because i don't want to like start on one to try and start on one half my head and then it's not gonna finish my entire head so i might just stick to this one or I might mix them so like I'll do one pump of this and then like most pumps of this um this is the male babasu is, is that how you pronounce that oh is it the focus here focus there you go babasu brazilian Ooh. there we go like trying to get my face out of the camera so that it focuses there we go brazilian curly cocktail curl mousse for dry and curly hair types dry okay yeah so we're going to do I haven't oiled my hair, so like I ha I've prepped it, so I've done my scalp, but I have not oiled my hair, so I'm gonna put mousse in first, and if that works, then I will be very pleased. I, I do have to go over it with oil, but I'm just gonna see whether or not this will be enough to style my curls just by itself. <sighs> Fingers crossed. Right, so what I'm gonna do first is I'm gonna separate the bottom half of my hair. Like you can see there is product that has all of my black shirt. I don't know why I'm wearing a black shirt when I know that I have a tendency to miss to get messy when I'm braiding my hair but I am obviously not with it today so I'm going to just take one pump of that and then I think two pumps of this one because oh okay first thing can see the difference in the mousse texture like this one's a very so this one is the male one and this one is the um crossbow one this is already very like loose texture i'm not sure if it's because there's like not much product in there but this the holly came out was very different like the male one came out like very light while this one came out more like structured as mousse so i don't know how to feel about that so i'm just gonna run it Bring my hands through it. Let's see if that works. Does that work? I don't know. Oh, but it smells lovely. Like the, the girls with one smells amazing. Um so we're gonna just do the rest of my we're gonna do one half of my head and we'll see if that I'm so scared. You can see on my face, I'm so scared that this doesn't work. We're gonna do one half of my head and we'll see if that makes any better. See you soon, guys. This is like the first half and oh first off, it's like very light. It's all it's also very light. Um obviously there's a lot of volume because I think this one says volume. Okay, it's over here. 
it does say volume bold so i am like obviously like, know that i've reread it because i didn't realize before but now that i reread it obviously there's like a little volume and it is very light and like that <sighs> but i don't know if it's gonna stay obviously my hair is gonna shrink quite a lot because it's wet and there's products and it's curling and all of that so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna finish off my my hair and then we'll see what we'll see how it looks when i'm putting the oil over it all <sighs> fingers crossed again guys so this is my hair post mousse so i did kind of like get some extra mousse and like rub it through my hair so i can see like it's all messy at the moment um so i'm just like getting rid of the of my hair so like i did that and i'm gonna go just run out here and you can see that it's all very it's very light and also very like soft for now <laughs> but what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna add some of my tried and true to my hair just to seal it up because i'd rather have that sealing especially since i'm gonna be i'm not gonna be washing my hair again for two weeks so i am just gonna do this and hopefully the end results will be nice i mean right now it looks really nice i think like the mixture that i did works the best for my hair because it's like the hold that it needs but at the same time it's not gel which my hair does get weighed out of it by gel um so it seems to be a really good um option what i did so i'm just gonna finish off and we'll see just how it looks in the end so what i do <laughs> uh, it looks kind of crazier at the moment like it looks less um i don't know if it looks any better or worse than i did before what i did is i added the oil um to my hair so i've added it in sections in four sections and i moved it through which is why you can see like some clumping in certain areas because i did add the oil and it kind of i guess disrupted the um curls that it created but then most of my natural curls are out anyways so i'm pretty okay with that um it is still very light so this doesn't weight on my hair at all which i'm very happy about because it's one reason i love it um and then these are like super lightweight i think i might actually have this as my routine now for my curls just add this to you know make it light and airy and then add this to seal it off however we won't know whether or not it's a good idea until like it dries down and we see it at the end of the day. So I am going to just let it be for now whilst I move on and do my makeup and I will let you know. Like I might post an update at some point whether or not I've actually liked it. But I do so far like the fact it's very airy, lightly and airy. I am still struggling to come to grips with the fact that my hair is this short. Like, it's growing out now, but I think that's making it worse because it's in that awkward phase where I can't really do much with it. Like, it's too short for me to do any of the hairstyles I used to do before it was when I was used to longer hair. And it's too <laughs> long to do any of the hairstyles that I kind of got used to doing while my hair was, like, really short. So, it's just in that phase where I'm just like, I don't know what to do with it. I really, I'm just like, you know, um, and it feels like it's not growing. I, it's just my charger, which oops, let me toss it over there. So then whatever I'm doing, I'm doing. But I've kind of gotten used to the fact that it's you know my hair is as short as it is. I think I sometimes I feel like it's not growing when I look at my hair. I'm just like, it's not growing, it's just staying the same. Like it's been the same length for like 10 years. But it actually is growing and I'm very grateful and it's very healthy. I recently, like recently, I did trim it. Um, I think in January, so I am very grateful for the fact that it's grown out enough where I could trim it and it's the curls are all very nice, very healthy. I don't have any thinning any point in any part of my hair and my hair is very much I could like I don't know if you saw that video where I got, where I was filming one video, I don't remember what it was, and I had blow dry my hair. Um I did straighten it and I think because of the oil in there it didn't straighten properly, which sucks, but I mean you live and you learn. And I hadn't straightened it in months. Like it's been, I haven't straightened my hair since last year. This time, I straightened it for Christmas when my when I got my hair done, and 
that was it. That was, so that's like 2022 Christmas. So it, it's been a while, right? Um, and I don't really do blow dry my hair either way. So never really did that anyways. So I'm getting used to like blow drying my hair again and straighten my hair again and all of that. It's been a, it's been a, a fun little thing for me. But um, I don't know. It's I like it. I might get used to it. We'll see. Uh, but thank you for watching this video. It's been it's like a really nice fun video. I don't know which one's gonna come out first. Um, this one or the other one. I just did um, my February's empties, and I was talking about how I'm gonna be gone for a while, which is why I'm filming everything right now. So if you're wondering why I'm wearing the same shirt, I did shower, but this is a clean shirt. I just put it back on for the video because I knew I was gonna get it dirty anyways. Um, so I did that, and I'm gonna film. Probably gonna film the next couple of videos over the next couple of days and see you know what happens so obviously i will be updating in those videos about my hair whether i loved it whether i hated it what on all of that and i hope that you guys stick around to see that love you guys and i will i will see you hopefully <laughs> we'll see you all in the next one